Hi, Hiram here. Since I did those videos on this uh, simple carbon felt burner, the small burner that's made with carbon felt on the inside, something simple, a DIY uh, project that almost anybody could do. But since I've been doing this, I've had uh, several questions and requests. Can this burner be made larger? Uh, do it on a larger scale? Can it boil more than a gallon? Can I make a larger one that would boil more than a gallon and a half? Or a gallon and a half? I don't know where that's coming from. A gallon, gallon and a half. I had several ask for that. So, uh, I did have another project that I did some time back where it was out of one of these old candle tins where I put carbon felt on the inside. This is going to be like a one shot thing where it's whatever fuel that you put in there. But I figured that might not be the answer. So I cut another, uh, I made another coddle stone, stove where you take the bottom out of one of those, I call them coddles, I don't know what it, the uh, can bottles, coddles. I just cut a one inch section out of this, filled it with carbon felt, uh, one inch high on the stove and it's about one and an inch, one and a quarter inch high for the carbon felt. I'll put the millimeters down in the text area. I didn't pack in the uh, carbon felt as heavy as I did on the other one. I let it expand more. But uh, this has been, the bubbler's been filling this. I think what you might want to do is like prime it beforehand. We could be here all day waiting for it to get the carbon felt wet from uh, scratch. So I'll do a test on this and see before I do the gallon, gallon and a half test, I thought I'd just see what it does for two cups of water. So let me go prep my water. I'll let this bubble in and I'll be right back. Okay, I've got my water prepped. I got this, I primed it a little bit with the bottle to speed things up. Lit it. This is what it looks like. Just the flame itself. Okay, so I'll put the pot cage on. This is a different pot stand rather. A little bit taller. But here's the water. Two cups. Setting at 59 degrees. Let's see. Two cups. 59. Room temperature is 46. Humidity 47. Okay, while that's going. One of the things I... What do I do with that burner? This burner is made where I have the carbon felt rolled up and filled in the whole thing, but I think that might be overkill. If you have been watching my videos for a while, you know some years back I made this. This is my first coddle stove. Again, it's the bottom of one of the coddles, I call them, can bottles. Uh, I lined it with exhaust wrap. It's the fiberglass stuff that you'd use on exhaust systems in cars. Just one ring of that held up by hardware cloth so that it's on the outside that pushes the hard the wrap to the outside edge. Then I just put alcohol in here and I burn it. It's worked well out on the trail. It's a little worse for wear now. It's kind of burned up and stuff. But it's worked out in the trail really good. And I think maybe that's what I have to do with this. The, filling the whole thing up with carbon felt might just be overkill. Because if you look at a flame, it's only the outside edge that's burning. Things on the inside, this whole inside surface isn't really in flames. It's just the outside edge going up. So after I do this, I may just play with it with a single piece of carbon felt and see what I can do there. Okay, so let me let this go. And I'll be back when it's boiling. There we have 210, 211, 212 in 5 minutes 58 seconds. Okay, not bad. So that was two cups of water starting at 59 degrees, came to a full boil, 
in 5 minutes 58 seconds. Didn't measure what the uh, how much was consumed. I mean, this thing is going to be an alcohol hog. Uh, another thing, I don't think this small pot. See how the flame's just going away there. A couple of things. I'm not sure that the pot is the right size for this burner. Uh, the flames were, if you saw on camera two, were out pretty close to the edge of the pot. Um, so a larger pot on this would really work better. Plus, I'm not sure if this, what I have on here is 16, 1 16th ID hose. I might need a larger hose like the 1 8th ID. I'm not sure if this is letting the alcohol come through fast enough. It's been bubbling the whole time, but uh, I'm not sure. I might play with that. So, that's my first test on this. I guess I'll try the, I do have, did I say? I do have the family pot, the old family camping pot. That should hold a gallon, maybe even a gallon and a half. And that would be a much better size for on this. Oops. So, I don't know what the interest is, but... I guess I'll do a uh, one gallon test on this. Okay, so I thank you for watching. I look forward to your input. I hope this helps people. I mean, this is a real easy burner for somebody to make. All you got to do is get a can, find your carbon felt, just poke a hole or drill a hole and put the uh, nipple in there. I don't know if you can see that. It's on the other side. Just a small brass nipple and you're off and running. So anyway, I thank you for watching. I look forward to your input, questions, remarks, helpful suggestions. And as always, watch for my buddy Max. Bye now.